Hello and welcome to my crazy kitchen and happy Super Bowl Sunday everybody. And with every Super Bowl, you have to have Super Bowl snacks. I have a fun one. I'm putting a spin on a favorite American classic sandwich, the BLT. And also, I'm going to have a fun way of making a meatball sandwich all for Super Bowl Sunday. Stay tuned. So today, I am making a BLT dip. How awesome does that sound, guys? I love BLTs. When I came across this, I had to make it. Dips are essential for the Super Bowl, and they're great for a party. So today, like I said, we're making the BLT dip, and it's real simple and basic. If you're uh, in crunch time like I always am, this is easy and simple to make, because here on the Crazy Food Crew Show, when we cook, it's basic, simple. Make sure it tastes good. So what goes into a BLT dip? Well, of course, can't forget the bacon, right? Bacon is the main reason. And with this, you could either cook up your bacon, cut it up, throw it in there, but I'm going quick today because the Super Bowl is right around the corner today. Uh, I'm gonna use real bacon pieces in mine. We got some mild cheddar cheese. We're gonna make ranch dip for the uh, base. We're not using mayo, we're gonna use a ranch dip. And also we got cream cheese that goes in there. We got tomatoes, diced tomatoes. We got our lettuce. We got sour cream for the ranch. I went ahead and I made my mixture of sour cream and ranch powder mix. We're gonna do one cup of the ranch mix. We're gonna put our cream cheese in. This is eight ounces. I already got the uh, whipped spread cream cheese. No, it's just spread. That way I don't have to let it sit and um, wait till it gets soft. Okay. So we got our eight ounces of cream cheese in there. So once you got your eight ounces of cream cheese in there, you want to mix this up real good. Okay, so you want to spread out your uh, cream cheese and ranch sauce there. You want to put in your chopped lettuce. Went ahead and chopped that up. And you just put that in there on top. Oh, this is gonna be so good. Mm -mm -mm. See that? Hope you guys can see that. You guys see that? Mm-hmm. And then we're gonna add the cheese. Uh, I'm gonna use mild cheddar. And you're just gonna sprinkle it on top, okay? Just making layers. Now our tomatoes, right? I drain these. No, don't put the whole can. Oh. Now we're not gonna put the whole can. We're gonna put enough on there. <clears throat> All right, spread your tomatoes out. And of course, everybody's favorite, the hero of this dip, bacon. And we're just gonna sprinkle all the bacon around on top. And let me tell you, I'm happy with this. This is my first time making it. This looks amazing. This is gonna make any Super Bowl crowd party happy. I wanna show you guys here. Look at that! We're not gonna mix it. You just got your layers, like a BLT sandwich. Bada bing, bada boom, how you doing? Then you're gonna cut up your pita bread. You can you can eat this with you know bagel chips, bread, chips, whatever you want. We're gonna try pita bread. I'm gonna cut it like a pizza. Check that out. I'm gonna use a spoon, dig some of this out all the way to the bottom. Oh my gosh, this looks amazing. Mm -mm -mm. This could be my favorite. That's really good. Simple and easy to make. 
the BLT dip, awesome. Now we're going to move on to a fun way of making a meatball sub. And this is going to be awesome because I never made it this way. And it's pretty basic and simple. Like I said, we're going to use a bun pan for this. We're going to spray it real good. And then you want to get the French, the Pillsbury French bread loaves. Get two of them. Okay. We got our Newman's own marinara sauce. We got some parsley flakes. We're using frozen Angus beef meatballs today, guys. And also, to put on our meatball sub, we got some sliced provolone cheese. We're going to set the oven at 350. It's already going. Like I said, we're going to spray our bun pan really good. Coat it really good. There you go. Oh, boy. Oh, I think I inhaled smoke butter. Is that a, is that a uh, thing, smoke butter? I don't know. Open up our French bread pizza. This is what always gets me. I'm peeling these and they go pop. So we got one open. Oh, oh we did it. Yay. Wasn't too bad, right? Wasn't too bad, right? Uh -oh. Okay, guys. So you got one roll, one loaf. We're just gonna put it. <laughs> we're just gonna put it in there, like that. Take your other loaf, put it, put it on the other side. And you wanna try to connect these as good as you can. Put this in the oven just like that for 28 minutes, guys. So, put that in the oven for 28 minutes. We're going to come back and check on it. Make our meatball sub. It's going to be delicioso. But, here's a little football trivia for you today. What teams have the most Super Bowl wins? Can you guess? Let me know in the comments. I already know. And that's why I'm picking San Francisco 49ers today to win the Super Bowl. So they can win... Their sixth Super Bowl to be tied with these other two teams with the most Super Bowl wins. Of course, my favorite team ain't in the Super Bowl. But it's okay because the Super Bowl is always fun to watch. We wait all year for it. And I want to know, who are you taking in the Super Bowl? Kansas City or San Francisco? I'm going with the 49ers. I think Nate is going with the Kansas City Chiefs. And I think the Wild Man, if I had to bet, he's probably going to take the Chiefs too. I want to know who do you think is going to win the Super Bowl this year. Let me know. All right. We'll be back soon to check on these uh, French bread loaves. All right. So it looks like our bread is done. We pulled it out of the oven. Now you want to get you a cookie sheet. And we're just going to flip this onto this. All right. Perfect. Now we got our ring. I'm going to get you a pretty good sized knife, sharp knife. We're going to cut this in half. The best... Hold on one second. Cut this in half the best way we can. Okay, guys. So now that we got it cut in half, which is kind of difficult, so make sure you got a real sharp knife. Now we're going to dig this bread out a little bit, hollow it out a little bit, so we can put our meatballs in there. And what you want to do is just kind of take your fingers and dig it out the best you can. Don't go all the way down. Now you kind of zap your meatballs up for about two or three minutes. We got our marinara sauce. We're using marinara sauce. You can use any sauce you want, spaghetti sauce, pizza sauce. We like marinara. Now we're just going to put our sauce in there throughout the bread here. All right, now we got our provolone. Now we're gonna fold it, our provolone, <clears throat> and just line it up here. And we're gonna hit it with some parsley. And you just wanna line up your meatballs around the sub ring here. Oops. So, I guess we could call this a meatball sub ring. Then we're gonna take 
It's a little bit of dollop here and dollop our meatballs on top. Okay. Like so. We're going to top it with some more cheese. Like so. And then we're going to top it. We're going to throw this in the oven for about 10 more minutes. A few moments later. Alright guys, our meatball ring sub came out of the oven. It went for 12 minutes, not 10 minutes. Depending on your oven, you might want to check it. So this went for 12 minutes. Look at that goodness. What I'm going to do is I'm going to use this Land O'Lakes garlic and herb butter spread. Put a little on the top. Give it a nice buttery, a nice garlic buttery top. It's going to be really good to bite into. All right, guys, there you go. Fun Super Bowl snacks to try out with your family. I'm Crazy Dad, and I want to thank you for coming into my crazy kitchen for this edition of Fun Super Bowl Snacks. I hope you have a great Super Bowl with some fun snacks. And if you would like to use these recipes, please share them with your family. And let me know what you think in the comments. And if you can, please hit that like button, subscribe to the Crazy Food Crew, because we're on the road to 1,000, and you can help us get there. We're planning a big party for that. And again, guys, thank you, and have a fun Super Bowl.